And somebody sent so uh, Mike Argo, uh, who watches the show, sent mm -hmm. me what it means when you uh, when you dream about flying. And, Go ahead. Um, it signifies your ability to conquer obstacles and rise above hardship. Hmm. Do you have some obstacles in your life, Rick? You need to tell uh, yeah, us about maybe. <laughs> I, I, I hear. I always thought it meant you were happy or you're free or you're whatever. Mm. But I don't know. But yeah, mm -hmm. I don't know. Well, maybe that's just one interpretation. Well, you gotta visit Doctor Phil or something. <laughs> 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 Rick's got some hardships in his life right now. <clears throat> All right, you guys, we've uh, we've got a heat advisory in effect for West Alabama, Pickens, Sumter, Green counties. Uh, it's these areas that are, are most likely to see the heat index today and getting to 105 or maybe a little bit higher. Here's a look at some of our forecast heat index values, and you can see close to 100 in Birmingham. So whether you're under an advisory or not, it is going to be very hot again today. 100 till a day. 97 in Aniston. Storms to our south, storms to our west. Things are pretty quiet here locally for the uh, the time being uh, as we put things into motion. Again, you can see not a lot showing up on the, the map, just a little bit of clutter. All right, let me take you through the future cast though for today, and we'll go with pretty limited coverage for this afternoon. I think as we heat up, we could see a few storms later on today, but then as we get into tonight and into the overnight period, this suggests that maybe we get another thunderstorm complex to march in from the west or northwest and impact maybe some of our southwestern counties before it finally kind of scoots off down toward the Gulf Coast. And then during the, uh, the day on Tuesday, some drier air starts to settle in. The humidity drops on Tuesday, but that only means that temperatures will be allowed to get even hotter. As far as severe weather risk today, there is a marginal threat, but mainly south and east of us. So look at our rain chances. Pretty limited over the next several days. I've got the impact symbol on Thursday and Friday because of the dangerous heat. So today 92, 94 Tuesday, 95 Wednesday. I mentioned the humidity drops Tuesday and Wednesday, and so the heat index will be pretty close to these air temperatures. By Thursday and Friday, though, the humidity is going to come back. That combined with a temperature nearing 100 degrees means that the heat index will likely range from 105 to 110 on Thursday. And then on Friday, we could actually see it maybe getting above 110 in some spots. So we'll likely have some heat advisories issued for Thursday and Friday, and it's possible we could even get some excessive heat warnings uh, during the, uh, the end of the week as well. Maddie? Steph, we're getting a beautiful view of Highway 280 as the sun is